so much hair, I feel like Rapunzel. Look, I can even make my own armpit hair right now. Oh, that's attractive. That's so attractive. Welcome to my channel. Oh my gosh, I have so much hair in my head right now. Like, I feel like my head could flop over. I have so much hair in here. I'll strangle you with your own hair extensions. Um, if you guys know me at all and you have followed me on social media, you know that this is not my real hair, sadly. This is my real hair. It's very short and very thin. So um, today I've put my extensions in for this tutorial. This is going to be a partnered video with Amika. So thank you, Amika, for partnering with me on this. Um, I've been using the High Tides Beach Waver by Amika for, um, I would say about a month and a half now, maybe two months. Um, I've used it in so many looks and every time I do, you guys are like, oh my God, it's Khaleesi. Or like, you look like a freaking mermaid. So you guys have been asking, uh, asking about how I got that hairstyle. So I figured I would do a little perfect summer hairstyle for you using some of my favorite products. Um, also summer is about to roll in. So you guys will have this in your back pocket in case you want to do a super simple, natural, beachy, sassy look. Um, so a lot of you guys have also been asking me about my extensions, how I put them in, what kind I use. So if you wanna see a video about that, I feel like that needs to kind of be its own thing, then let me know in the comments below. But let's go ahead and get started. I'll show you um, how I get really nice beachy waves while still taking good care of my hair. You guys know that my hair is definitely compromised. I color it a lot, I remove color a lot. So we like to be as kind to our hair as possible. So this is the damage free version of beachy waves, okay? Let's get started. <laughs> So this is the High Tide Deep Waver by Amika. So you're gonna turn this on and you can actually control the temperature, but I do want to show you that it defaults to 200 degrees Celsius. So the reason why this is important is because the first time that I used this, I had it all the way up to 200 degrees Celsius, which I believe is about 400 actual degree, like degrees Fahrenheit. So for my hair, I never want to put 400 degrees on my hair. It will literally break off. So um, that's just because my hair is damaged and fine. And that's just, that's just the lot I was given in life. Don't ask me because if I could have it any other way, I'd have thick, amazing hair. And this is what my hair would look like without extensions. So, um, so this is getting up to the temperature it needs to be at. It actually gets there really quickly. I'm gonna turn this down to 100 degrees Celsius. Actually, I'm gonna do about 130. So while this is heating up, um, let's talk a little bit about this. So one of the things that I really love about this as opposed to other um, waivers is that the shape that it is, if you can see that, it's like two curling iron barrels, whereas a lot of waivers are more of a harsher triangular shape. So it's more of a like harsher crimp, crimp wave, as opposed to like a rolling kind of beachy wave. So that's one thing that differentiates this for me. Um, and you're covering a lot of, of, of space with this. So it really doesn't take a whole lot of time to get your hair done. It's pretty simple. So um, that's this guy. But before we go into that, I'm gonna let that heat up. We're gonna go in with a couple different things. First, um, I already have a little bit of this in my hair because uh, you can do it by the roots and it kind of acts as a dry shampoo soaking up some oil and it also gives you a really nice lift at the root for really flat, fine hair. Or maybe your hair isn't flat or fine, but you just really like that like second day hair kind of look because everyone knows like the first day you wash your hair, you're just like, oh my gosh, my hair is so flat. Well, not anymore. Um, this is Got Grit by Amika. It looks like this. I'm taking a little bit of this. You're gonna emulsify this between your fingers and then you're going to apply this to your root. And if you want a more pieced out look, 
Um, see, it's not like sticky, which is amazing. It's actually like turning into a dry shampoo like in my hands. If you want a more pieced out look, what you're gonna do is apply this to your ends. See how it just kind of pieces out? Um, so if that's the look you're going for, then you can kind of apply this to your ends wherever you feel like you want a more PC look. I like to do this to my bangs. So this is already giving me like more body and more texture. Before we apply heat to the hair, I never blow dry or use any hot tools on my hair without using a heat protectant. So today we're gonna be using the Amica Blockade and you're gonna use like one to three pumps just depending on you know how much hair you have, what you're working with. Mix this up in your hands and then just start applying. I apply this to my hair anywhere where I'm going to be heat styling. I'm never heat styling near the root but I especially like to get this into the ends because those are usually like the driest and the most brittle. So this is gonna protect our hair from heat and it kind of wraps it in like a cocoon of nutrients. So this is a must if you're using any heat styling products or even blow drying. I'm gonna go in with the waver and what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to separate my hair like this and then I'm gonna work side by side and then work on the back at the end. So I'm just gonna clip this together. Okay, so I'm gonna, oh, my shirt's coming off. It's not that kind of video, guys. I'm gonna start, I, for underneath the hair, you really don't need to get that close. Just kind of do what's gonna be showing. So I kind of start over here and I like to hold this on for about 10 seconds and then I move it down. And there is our super beachy, pretty wave. Another thing you can do to make this look even more natural is instead of doing it this way down the hair, you can turn it this way, sideways, and do it this way, and then they, will, they won't like lay right in one another, and it'll be a little more tousled, a little more messy, and a little more natural looking. Okay, now we've waved the entire hair. This is a very important step. The next two steps are actually very important. We're gonna be using the Bushwick Beach No Salt Spray by Amika. This stuff is very potent, it's very strong, it's very powerful. So make sure you use just a little bit. You can always add more. This has no salt in it, as the name suggests, so it's really good for dry hair, hair that really can't take too much like grit and grime to it. Uh, maybe it's thin, maybe it's damaged. This also will not remove the color out of your hair since there is no salt in it. Uh, so this is perfect for damaged hair, compromised hair, colored hair. So I like to start by spraying a couple sprays in this. And like I said, I like to add on to it because it is very, it's very strong. It means business. So this is perfect even if you're not doing waves, you just want that like sexy beachy hair. This will make that happen. gives really awesome texture too. So with all these products, like you should have some seriously nice textured hair like this. Now that this is as textured as I'd like it, I like to take a little comb like this and just piece it out even further, kind of break up any like wave patterns that are too clumped together. This will also give you even more volume by separating these. This also helps you find any stragglers that you totally missed. And we are done. This is the final look, the beachy waved hair. Um, and from here, you can kind of do whatever you want with this. You can put it up in a half pony. You can do a little braid down here. You can flip this back. There's so many things you can do with this once you're to this point. You have so much texture um, in your hair without it being like, cement to get through that you can kind of style this however your little heart pleases. Um, so 
yeah, this is the way that I've been doing my hair and beachy waved look. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And also let me know if you want to see more hair videos. I would absolutely love to do more of them for you. If there's a specific style you've seen on Pinterest or something and want a tutorial of it, I was going to say text it to me. I'm like, do you guys have my phone number? Probably not. By texting, why am I saying texting? None of y'all have my phone number or maybe you do. You really suck. Tweet me pictures, like maybe you found something on Pinterest that you want to see, um, and I will uh, maybe feature it in an upcoming video. All of the products in this video you can get at uh, Sephora, so I will link those for you in the description box below. Enjoy. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.